What is up everybody? Welcome back to a brand new video. It's your boy Jonas here and today guys we are now on the next episodes of the Amazing World of Gumball Season 5. Let's get it. Woo! The Matchmaker. All right, let's see the story. Okay. All right, all right, all right. Oh shit. What the fuck is this? Ooh. Why is it so good? <laughs> uh. like some sad hard punk song. Mm. Get it. Mm. <laughs> why do I, why are the song this show is so good, man? What's going on, bro? <laughs> Whose photo are you singing about? Hmm. No one's. Then if you excuse me, I'm gonna go look wistfully at the sunset. Dude, it's 2 p.m. It's 2 p.m. Then I'll be gone for a while. Hmm. Is he gonna a photo? Terry. Terry? Aw, oh, he loves her, but he doesn't know how to tell her. This kid needs help badly. <laughs> then there's only one person who can help him badly. What's enough. up with that face? What the fuck? The plan is we make her fall in love with you. Then you guys date, become high school sweethearts, go to separate colleges, and probably experiment more. But one day you'll do an online search to see if either of you got fat or bald. Next thing you know, you'll be paying a ton of money on <laughs> That's how people do it, man. I'm telling you. Because by the time you realize your mistake, you'll be in your winter years, where all that matters is having someone to fight with. What are you talking <laughs> about? <laughs> Sorry. Normally I would talk through my plans with Darwin, but he yeah. can't really know about this mm -hmm. one. That wasn't a plan. That was just a series of bleak things that'll probably happen. Yeah. yeah, but still. Would you mm -hmm. help me make her fall in love with Darwin? Well, it depends. Who's the her in this conversation? Yeah, I thought, Terry, didn't Darwin, Darwin like her? Oh, really? I see. I know. Why is it Terry? I thought he was into you, but nope. It's definitely Terry. There's photographic evidence if you want to see it. <laughs> look, look, look. Aw, oh, come see? on, dog. Gumbo, why are you. Look at it. Don't rub it in her Can face. You see? Look, <laughs> look. Look. <laughs> You're not looking. <laughs> the only difference between love and I Terry thought Darwin liked Carrie. The only difference between me and you is. is The way I'm smelling. Hmm. The way I'm smelling. <laughs> <laughs> uh -uh. Can kids buy potions? What do you mean? You know, some kind of love potion that tricks you into thinking everyone is beautiful. Yeah. That sounds more like a mistake potion, and we need a fake ID to buy one. Well, do Wait, you know what? how to make one? We need to help him out before he grows a fringe. Mm -hmm. No, sorry, I don't. And what's wrong with emo hair? Uh... <laughs> I suppose it's not for everyone. <gasps> the emo hair. Idea. They say the feeling of falling in love is similar to experiencing a life or death situation. All so, right, so... So, let's give Terry a little adrenaline rush. Come on, I need your help. <laughs> oh, sure, I'll help you. Okay, nice. I'll help you fail. Yeah. Don't want to carry for life. What the fuck? <laughs> oh, come on, Carrie. Kind of looks like soda. No, it's a chemical that will completely destroy your metabolism, deforming your body until your butt crack reaches your shoulder blade. Oh my God, just give up, man. Yeah. you're such a hypochondriac. <laughs> no! The quarantine room is right there. <sighs> well, I guess we should get Darwin out of the quarantine room before the nurse gets back. What? Wait, what? I don't think there's a cure for that. What the fuck is he doing? What are you doing? I mean, in as much as I can before it comes back. Before what comes what back? What comes back? Yeah. 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 Ew. Stomach. Okay. Oh, he's got Nazis. You know what all, all right. girls like? <laughs> Being too like they're all the same and having generalizations made about them? They all love a guy who's not scared of being vulnerable. Share your secrets. She'll love you for your imperfections. I, I can respect I that. Think okay. Gonna yeah. Fall for a guy who pees in the fishbowl when the water's cold. Fine, whatever. It wasn't my <laughs> idea anyways. It was hers. <laughs> okay. She wants me to expose myself? Then I expose myself. What? Wait, wait, wait. What? <laughs> <laughs> I have a cloak up, but I don't know what it is, and I'm too scared to look it up. Once I had a bit of meat stuck in my teeth for a week, I swallowed it instead of spitting it out, and it tasted Ew, like Ew, okay, paste. you're nasty, you Darwin. I forget how to walk. Okay, bye. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> <laughs> right. So I'm saying, I thought it was so always Carrie and Darwin, not and hope that Darwin, Darwin and Carrie. <gasps> Great plan. Thank you. If C stands for seriously stupid, <laughs> that's not how you spell serious, yeah. so that doesn't even work. Mm -hmm. And we're not at plan S yet, so shh. That starts with an S. 
Mm. Why did you have to drag me into this? You know very well that I like Darwin. It's mm. written all over my face. Yeah. Your face is literally two dots in a line. It's like more <laughs> two dots in a line. What does that expression even mean? I know you really have no emotion if you think about it. <laughs> oh. It's like look, sadness. Look, I I'm really sorry. He's just not into you, I guess. Mm. I meant I'm disappointed in myself. Why? If you like someone, you're supposed to help them find happiness. Oh. Not ruin their chances. Mm. Come here. <laughs> <laughs> Roach is a ghost. <laughs> also, I lied. About what? I do know how to make a love potion. Oh, okay. A part of him, a part Issue. of her, and one last ingredient. Okay. The tear of someone who loves him. <laughs> Oh, yeah. What the fuck? Where's that music coming from? <laughs> it's just what happens when you stir a love potion. You put R and B jams into it. It's fine. This is all. Don't break up with. the ship. Uh, wait, uh, what are you doing? Well, I thought it would be more romantic than putting it in their drinks when they're not looking. That's uh, actually more sensible, though. Mm. If you think about it, using the arrows is like more dangerous. Ow, that's the hurt. <laughs> I can still see it. You still see it though. <laughs> God damn, so much cologne, man. Relax. I know. I'm pretty sure you just put the ozone layer, man. I just want to spell my best for my date. <clears throat> what? Well, I think I'm owed a little thank you. <laughs> Bro, there's so much cologne in that room. <laughs> I think I'm owed a little thank you for fixing your love life. What are you talking about? Mm -hmm. Darwin, I saw it. So what? what? Your photo of Terry. <laughs> let's just say Carrie and I lent a helping hand. And let's just say that this helping hand involved the dark arts and a dangerous weapon. Yeah. Oh, that's not a photo of Terry. It's of Carrie. But she doesn't show up on film. Ah. Uh, damn. What? Yeah, so they did like each other. Ooh. Anyway, gotta go. That's terrible. That's terrible. Carrie, Carrie, Carrie. What? Give me a gentle slap on the arm. What was that for? <laughs> slap in the I face. Got it all mixed up. Darwin never loved Terry. He loved you. He's slapping me already. That's why. So what now? Instead of playing matchmaker, we're gonna have to play matchbreaker. Okay. So gotta do it. Gotta break them up. Terry invited you to an event. Your wedding. Wedding. Your wedding. <sighs> Attending. No, no, no. Oh, okay. All right, I like it. What's that for? A crime of passion. Beat his ass. Uh, she's too good not to be shared. <gasps> okay. <laughs> What's that? Oh, he gained weight. Future father in law. I'm sorry. Please don't judge me. It wasn't hygienic, but I guess you cleaned it. Not for that. For this. Richard, you nasty fuck. Ugh. I feel sick, man. Carrie? Hello? Gumbo. See, I question it all the fucking time. <laughs> Mostly gumball. What? What's wrong? Oh. Mm. Why the face? Mm. Damn. Yes, you two, get together. Fuck's sake. Let's go! I think the ship, I think it broke. The spell's broke. Yeah, see? Woo. True love broke the spell. Yeah. Come on. Say something. Do, do it, do it. Get in there. Uh, hey. About so time, Jesus. Like to go out somewhere sometime and do something? Or, or we could go somewhere else sometime and do some... Just get together already. They both sound great. Mm -hmm. Hold on a second. <laughs> Those two kind of are meant Please. to be the cologne, uh, this disinfectant spray. <laughs> Woo! Nice. Now I can 
still see, but I don't mind. <laughs> but I don't mind. <laughs> Ooh, okay, this episode. Uh, I liked it. I think it was about time because I think these two pretty much liked each other throughout Gumball for like a, a long time. I mean, Darwin and Carrie, man, love too much. It's, it's sweet. It's cute. Just like Penny and Gumball, this is sweet. It took, I think, almost almost four seasons, but it finally happened. But yeah, episode's great, so let's hop the next one. Here we go. The box. All right, let's see what's going What is it? Ooh, okay, what is it? Did anyone order anything? Nah. This yeah. was the credit card company's answer when I asked if I can order things online. <laughs> it's been like that for three days. I think they're working in shift. Yeah. Was delivered to our door, so. Open it. Open it. Uh, uh, opening Wait. other people's mail is a crime. Oh, why is there always a law against I know, and I used... do? Because the last thing you wanted to do was move into the supermarket so you could eat for free. Uh, <laughs> if the food enters your body and exits it while it's still in the supermarket, it's technically not stealing. Hmm. True. Come that on, is technically true. I'm the only one who wants to open the box. Opening other people's mail is like staring at the sun. The okay. more people tell you you shouldn't do it, the more you just go. No, I want to open Richard, it. What's that? over here. Oh, yeah. Sorry. Now, kids, there's plenty of fun things we could do to take our mind off opening the box. Just think outside the box. Play some music on the boom box. Open the box. Open, box. open the box. Open it. Wait, I think I know what it is. What is it? It's a teleportation gun. Could you possibly know what a fictional okay, the same portal. sounds like? Uh, what does a laser sword sound like? <laughs> Case closed. Box right. open. Open. We're not opening it. Oh, come on. Think about how this could benefit society and enrich our lives. Mm -hmm. Just open the box, Gumball, Jesus. I told you to take out the garbage. Okay, nice. It could be a portal gun, dude. I'm not sure I'm comfortable with this. Speak for yourself. Okay, I get it. Hi, Mom. What are you doing? I just found a way to avoid walking. Are you sure that thing is safe? Mm -hmm. I think so. What makes you say that? Uh, probably that way. I can tell the creators really love the game Portal because they've done it before. <laughs> it seems teleportation is dangerously affecting your DNA. So mm. you're saying I'm getting superpowers? Yeah. Mm, no, that's a rather specific interpretation of what I just said. But you're not saying that I won't. Indeed. You're not getting but superpowers, but you can... 99.9% chance you will turn into a cyst-like pile of flesh with tongues where there shouldn't be tongues. Mm. Uh, so you're saying there's a 0.01% .01 chance that I could get superpowers? <laughs> Bro, what's with these? Yeah, see? Hey, dude. Whoa. Oh, looks like you've been teleporting. Oh. Whoa. What's that? I've been Kill trying it. to get superpowers. Kill it. Kill it. Fly, Kill it. So I took a bird through the portal. But instead, now I can lay eggs. Then I tried to get invisibility. So I took a chameleon through. And now I can Just kill it. Egg. Kill it. And then I tried to get super jump. So I took a frog through. And now mm. you can lay. Oh. Uh, yeah. So uh, I decided to take something that couldn't lay eggs. And ta da. Bro, that's ah, fucking gross. Pointer. Did it work? Uh, sure did. Check this out. Laser vision! Oh, great. <laughs> now I can see exactly where you're looking. But yeah. maybe you should focus some of your efforts on the aesthetic side of superhero. Maybe look a little less like... A monster? That. Yes. Oh, you're right. I need to merge with something that looks super cool. Like I said, kill it. Kill it. Okay, please. wait a minute. I'm just gonna say what we're all thinking. Please do. Are you gonna finish that fictional food that's on your plate? What? No! <laughs> Why did you choose to merge with a cockroach? I know. Just imagine what I could do with the powers of a nuclear resistant parasite. Repel girls even more. Mm -hmm. I still Pretty much know that. what it is, but I know what I wish it was. What? Bro, we're rich! Money! <laughs> <laughs> Nothing is money, imagine. I could get a submarine to school every day! But there's no water between here and school. Yeah. We'll buy some! Exactly! I can finally call myself retired instead of unemployed! Let's go! Mom, where are you taking us? Yeah. You see, such a large amount of cash is bound to belong to somebody shady, and it's very likely that ah! oh. send someone to retrieve it. <laughs> oh, what? fuck. So now we're on the run from a hitman? Yeah, <laughs> basically. Jesus. <laughs> I mean, this wouldn't be really much out of the ordinary for Nicole, if you think about it. If it's money, she'll do it. Ooh. That's scary, dude. So now we have to live every day like it's our last? Yeah. Yes. But isn't that a good philosophy to have? Carpe diem! Ooh. Bro! <laughs> Why isn't the call up normal with this shit? <laughs> I think I know how he's tracking us! I'm sorry, 
Sorry, I'm just so scared. Not that. There must be some kind of tracking device in the money. Yeah, it's in the box, most likely. <laughs> My employers will never give up. There will be another Jesus. man after me, then another, and another after that. You will never find peace. Mm -hmm. Yes, but we're millionaires. You will never get Pretty much. to your own Pretty much. You will be hunted. Hunted millionaires. You will never be able to trust anyone. You will be fugitives. Jesus, Nicole. No fucks given. Inside this box is clearly evil. What? Why? Because history has proven that mysterious containers always bring misery. Pandora's box. Okay, what's maybe it's an item? The Lost Ark? <laughs> that six month old takeout box at the back of the fridge? <laughs> My point is, what if this box was never meant to be opened? What if it was? I would just open it. It's been seven weeks since the infection began, and I still have. Oh, this is um shit. It was a movie. Chlorophyll. Our infrastructure has collapsed. The people are on their own. Or a zombie movie. You have reached the mailbox of. <laughs> <laughs> All our officers are busy consuming the flesh of the living at the moment, so please take the law into your own hands. <laughs> Wait up. Ah, cool. <laughs> Most of the population is now contaminated. Those that haven't transformed yet were already zombies anyway. What? Oh, okay. He's got legs. Bro, why did you even stop? We know it is coming to an end. If only I'd known how the virus got out, maybe the infection could have been prevented. How did it all stop? Basically, Cloverfield or quarantine in those movies. That was the end of that, wasn't it? Destroy that box. I'm sure it's something perfectly normal. Just open it. Exactly. Like an accordion made out of bread or a remote controlled trumpet. Uh, what? <laughs> okay, what would you think it is? A cell phone? Yes. Lazarus. Lazarus. A scientist have inserted an implant allowing you to use the capacities of your brain at 100%. Okay, I don't know what this movie is. <laughs> We will I know it's a parody of a movie. Place you under a false identity until it is time for your mission. Last I'm not tripping. Your mission is to save the president. Please hang up. This phone will self-destruct. So Richard would be in like an action movie. What the fuck? <laughs> Ooh. Oh shit. Or maybe it's Fast and Furious. I'm tripping. <laughs> I think he's supposed to be Steven Seagal. If I'm thinking Mr. about it. President, are you okay? I was so scared. Don't worry, you're safe now. Is that George Bush? <laughs> yeah. Wait. What? Wait. No wait. Offense, Dad. Wait. It sounds cool that you could use the full power of your brain, but 100% of nothing is still nothing. Hmm. Please hang up. This phone will self-destruct in 10 seconds. No, you hang up. <laughs> Hang up. No, you first. This is a direct order. Please hang up. All right, we'll do it at the same time. Oh my god. No, wait. We need to That's how what pretty much would happen. The president has to be saved and kiss. What if it was Why just kiss? Box? That would be a huge letdown. Think about it. A cardboard box could be a spaceship, a time machine, a pie. See, Darwin knows what he's the cardboard box for. Through the eyes of a kid. I said it would be a huge letdown. So I just open it then. Decided. I just want the box. We need to destroy it. No, I saw it first. It's mine. Give it to me. You know. Oh. Oh no. Oh. Wee. Oh, okay. Jesus. Ah, oh, man. Wait. My favorite. Have you guys received a package by any chance? I told them to leave it here if I wasn't home. <gasps> e nope, Dad, nope. Didn't see it. I think so. Didn't see it. Uh, never mind. Wait. Maybe we opened it by mistake. What was inside? You don't want to know. 
Trust T me, tell us. we really do. Okay, you know that rough skin you have on your elbow? Well, imagine that, but a bit scalier. It's no. spreading over no. your okay. entire uh, Bye. place Bye. that should be soft. <laughs> under this kind of blister that's sort of filled with some butter-colored oil yeah. matter, and then it started sweating. Kind of like cheese, but on live meat. Until it hardened into a flaking crust. Guess I'm saying. Well, the box had some cream in it for that. You're right. We didn't want to know. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Woo! Okay, this episode. Uh... It was all right. I mean, I was kind of curious what was in the box. I mean, the whole family had their own interpretation of it, but damn. I mean, the ending was kind of, well, it wasn't really much of a letdown because it was Mr. Robinson, but damn, I really thought it would have been a cool item in the box. Maybe something fun. Like they always have at the end of, at the end of every episode, but uh, really love the episode. So let's have the next one. Here we go. The console. All right. Sue, start. Hmm. <clears throat> What? Remember what? your last birthday present? How can I forget? What was it? was an IOU. Well, I'm <laughs> IOU. gonna need that back. Because... <gasps> you got me a game! A Game Boy? Child? Made in Chainor? This is such a knockoff. Even the country it was made in is a knockoff. Ha. Did you buy it for Hey, man, you got a Game Boy. Man? Yeah, the awesome store. What's the problem? The Everything awesome store. <laughs> Our TV is a soppy. Only two letters different, but that never stopped you from watching it. Yeah. Our superhero, Batman. He's a knockoff, too, but you love his morally dubious adventures. Yeah. Even our doctor only has a doctorate in fine art, but he did a great job on my appendix scar. Mm. Okay, Thungs. What? That's knockoff for thanks. Thanks. That's the spirit. He's a one of those paradox. two. The enemy within? JRPG titles never make sense. That's supposed to be Final Fantasy? Words thrown together. Fashion equivalent would be wearing a Hawaiian shirt, ski boots, and a top hat. Mm. Yeah, actually, that does explain how the characters normally look. Mm, yeah, it's like Kingdom Hearts, I think. Uh, Let's start. Not working. Go to bathroom, bathroom, attic, attic bedroom. bedroom. Oh, it's a video game episode. Dude, nice. There you are. Sorry, I forgot your name. Please enter, enter your name. <gasps> I've trapped us inside a video game. I'm saying awesome. that's cool, dude. Please, my butt. Tell me what's going, going on. on. <laughs> a foul curse has been unleashed upon our town by <laughs> my butt. You mean the gates of doom were opened by my oh butt? My God. The fabric of the universe was ripped <laughs> apart by. My butt, my butt has me quite a mess. <laughs> that's funny, that's funny. Some Here's some healing ointment to help my butt in the heat of battle. <laughs> nope. Oh, that would be funny. Arise, and and Darwin had... So this is like Final Fantasy in RPG games. Yeah. Oh no! The path is blocked by... Oh my god, straight up show. Pokemon vibes right here. We are apparently too stupid to walk on the lawn. Yes. My butt uses axe. It is ineffective. What? My butt uses saw. It is ineffective. Can my butt just use common sense and walk around it? Uses sarcasm. It is, is ineffective. ineffective. <laughs> okay, so this is kind of like. No, actually, no, this is like Final Fantasy. I'm pretty sure I can handle a few of Oh, critical damage. My butt. Yeah, critical damage. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the name. To fire yes, I think most things are susceptible to fire attacks. So burn it. Thanks. Dude, I like this. This is a fun episode. They did it. Nice. Okay, this is like Final Fantasy. Yeah. So this is the Final Fantasy episode. Leslie? Oh, Leslie. I bought some fertilizer from the awesome store. I went home after visiting the awesome store <laughs> and used the fertilizer I just bought at the awesome store. The awesome store. Okay, okay, we got it. We got it. The awesome store is the villain. The awesome, awesome store. store. I can't. There's no command to skip through his cutscenes. Awesome Do something. Hold on. <laughs> the awesome... Perfect. We could have just walked away. I know. But now maybe we should run. <laughs> Jesus. All right. What are we doing at Mr. Robinson's? Getting loot. I think you mean looting. No, if there are items hidden in these pots, they must be for me. No, I'm pretty <laughs> sure the mailman hid them there so people like you wouldn't steal them. He pretty much that shit. Right? No, that's how it works in RPGs. Well, oh, look, Mr. Robinson. I He's the NPC. There was no Buddha playing. Right now, it just feels like you're ransacking an old man's house. For, yeah, sure yeah, Mr. you're just Robinson doing that. Doesn't mind. Welcome to my home. Please take whatever you need for your quest. Yeah, NPC shit. I'm gonna go sleep in his bed now. <laughs> he took his money. 
Alright. What's with this new outfit? Oh, Don't explain nice. why this gigantic sword has a trigger. Yeah, well, you did mm. reject the alternative outfit. Yeah, I don't think that was age appropriate. But those leather platform boots would have given you plus five. Okay, vision. I like what you do with that. Well, That's they funny. Make you taller, don't they? Oh, that actually makes sense. Mm -hmm. Penny. <laughs> Dude, now I want a gumball game. I want an RPG of gumball. Do it. Oh, how about a gift? Okay, do it. VHS tape. It worked. <laughs> Funny. Thanks for saving me. The cell phone I bought from the awesome store took possession of me. Here, take it. It will help you in battle. Smartphone acquired. Okay, I guess it worked. Now summon friends in battle. Yeah. Thanks, Sorry about the whole disfiguring you with the VHS player thing. He is mad. Half her head's gone. Just describe. <laughs> Uh, okay. Wait, I think this person has a clue for us. Really? I okay. wonder what makes you say that. The sunlight. Hello, I've lost my pigeons. Will you help me find them? Ah. No! Uh, so side quest that preys on every gamer's weakness. Yep, that Pigeon was me. Chips and sugary drinks. No. The sun? No. The compulsive need to complete every game to a hundred percent. That's most. I've met people like that. I get like that too. I gotta get 100% in the game. <laughs> no life trophy. Worth it. Okay, we need to find this awesome store before. Bro, I want a, a, an RPG gumball. Where is it? There must be a clue somewhere. How about that? <laughs> the hair. The awesome store. Yeah, that'll be it. Wait, we can't go yet. We don't have enough XPs to fight the boss. Then we'll True. Do the thing that makes up most RPGs. Level up. Grind. Yeah, that? grind and level up. Menial enemies until we're stacked. Pretty much. Yeah. That was me back in the days to grind the hell out of my players. Hmm, still need more XPs, but there are no enemies left to fight. <laughs> <laughs> Keep kicking people's asses, man. <laughs> nice. Strong enough to take on the awesome star. Let's go. Wait, don't you kind of want to hear that awesome battle music one night? Yes, it's epic. I want to play. That's actually a good theme, man, for a game. Guys, ready? Cause there's no turn. Hell yeah, let's go. Oh, man. No, no, no. We've all ran into that mistake too a couple times. Well, who is this guy in the, that runs the awesome store? I don't think we've ever seen him. It's like some shadow figure. Green. Yeah, see, we've never seen his face. Ooh. I was about to explain how we're allies. Sorry, it's just yeah. you look so evil and you sold people all those cursed objects and stuff. Or yeah, pretty much. When they buy things from the back of a van. Meh, fair point. Mm -hmm. Anyway, what were you saying? The secret is not a game. Okay, what is it then? To beat the game is to beat the game. Uh, explain, please. What? Yeah. The console is the enemy. Oh, inverted paradox. The enemy within. So the name actually meant something. Makes sense because we're playing the game in real life and the enemy is... Is the Game Boy? Is that Zephyroth? I think it's supposed to be that. We don't have the console anymore. Take it on, hand to hand. Hiya! Aren't you supposed to actually hit it? Yeah. I'm not touching that with my bare hands. I don't know where its tentacles have been. <laughs> oh, Jesus! Wait, what happens in this game if we perish? I guess we perish in the real world too. Oh my what God. Was? We'll have to restart the whole game from the beginning. No, we ain't doing that shit. <laughs> Just use it. Fuck it. <laughs> God damn it, Gumball. Cut out the homies. <laughs> Rain freeze. Ooh, there we go, Hector. Thousand blows. Dude, I love this episode. I love it too much.
Stop hitting yours out. Okay, who is Give me a shot. Ugh. Ooh. Alright. <laughs> Nicole! Woo! Richard. Get him, man. They gonna do it? Ring of fire? <laughs> Did it work? Nice. I think, yeah, they did it. Woo! Da -da. I love that theme too much. I love it. Yeah, this is basically Final Fantasy. Dad, no one cares about the credits. Congratulations. You completed the game at 89%. Mm -hmm. Yay! What do you 89. Mean 89%. Do you want to start a new game? <gasps> yes. <laughs> Woo! Okay, this episode. <laughs> I love it too much, man. I'm sorry. I'm a huge fan of RPGs and, you know, Final Fantasy and so forth. Episode's perfect, so the game basically... Well, Gumball got some I inverted Game Boy, and it turned out to be like a Final Fantasy type of like RPG uh, lifestyle he was living. But it was honestly really good. You know, we got we got a couple hints of like some video game, you know, innuendos that they were doing. Yeah, I really love the episode. Was a banger, man. It's like just straight out of Final Fantasy. Love it too much. Uh, but yeah, let's have the next episode. Here we go. The Ollie. All right, let's do the story. Jesus. Wrong way, Richard. <laughs> Oy, don't press it, don't press it, don't press it, don't press it. No! What are you doing? I know. I was trying to fix the roof, and you saved me. Uh, no, I just saved my skateboard. Oh, is that what this thing is? Yeah, why? It's a skateboard. What did you use it for? Yeah. Uh... Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Oi. Mm. Bro, what the fuck is wrong with you? <laughs> mm. I've been using it for that thing Gumball said. Land surfing. Skateboarding. Skateboarding. Yeah, but that still doesn't explain why you own a skateboard. Yeah. Uh, duh, because I'm a skater. <laughs> <laughs> what? Why is everyone laughing? I'm pretty sure Mr. Dad is laughing so he doesn't feel left out. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> others are laughing because you're clearly a poser. Ooh. What do you mean I'm I heard a poser, poser man. man? I've never seen you ride a skateboard before. He yeah, rode before. When they were old men, I think. You mean like how I've never seen you from profile? What do you mean? Well, like how you always hold your head at a three-quarter angle because you look weird otherwise. I don't see how that proves I'm a poser. <laughs> <laughs> so you're saying you're a skater? Totally. So I you prove can it. skate. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. He can. So We've I seen him do it. Do a trick right now with this very board. You could. Sure. Ooh, do it though. <laughs> do an all That's all you gotta do. The easiest trick to learn. Awesome. Then you can teach me. <laughs> Oi. <gasps> what are you wearing? What's what? wrong? Dude, it's safety you don't gear, man. Wear safety stuff. You just carry it with you at all times, so people know you're choosing not to wear it. <laughs> what if I hurt myself bad? I know. Then you get to feature in Elmore Streams Fail Compilation of the Week. That's YouTube. <laughs> really, really bad. Then you get to feature in Elmore Streams Fail Compilation of the Month. Ooh, don't. okay. Before you can even it's get worth on the board, it. worth it. you need to look the part. Skaters wear like rags, shoelaces for belts because that is also true. Off. I have seen that Where did they too get many their times. From then? The thrift store? No, from the skate shop. What's Go to this? Dickies, Everything couple other places. I think. Yeah. Ha! You sack and form his drone. <laughs> you sack and form his drone. That's I had that overall too. Okay, now we have to figure out whether you ride goofy. Overall, or the I same shirt. Kind of goofy right now. Do you ride with your left foot or with your right foot? I believe all feet were created equal. Ugh. Okay, which foot do you ride with? Yeah. <sighs> okay, just let yourself fall. Do you forward. do stray or goofy? <laughs> what was that? Goofy stance. Uh, I thought that was some kind of skater chest exercise. No. I was test to see which foot you would put forward first, and uh, okay, do it again. Do it again. Ugh, forget it. Come on, let's roll. Yeah. Not literally, split, dude. Split, dude. So who invented skateboarding? No one really knows its true history. It's I think it came from France, if I'm not mistaken. I think. I'm not 100% sure. I don't... It 
all started a long time ago. <laughs> History of skateboarding. Let's see. There he is, Lord Hamilton. The ruffian who stole your pocket watch. Criminy, I need to find a way to escape from these gentlemen. <laughs> Look, a skateboard. <laughs> oh my god. Let's hurry up and make it. Jesus. I say, chaps, I wager one could fashion some sort of vehicle from these. Good day to you, sir. Good day to you, sir. <laughs> that story sounds like a load of poppycock, me lad. It doesn't Poppy matter, cock. dude. What's important is for you to understand the spirit behind skateboarding. Okay, what is it? Yeah. It's a deep and profound philosophy that mostly centers around ragging on kids on scooters and people on roller skates. Ah, like fuck the scooters, man. Mind, Scooter gang. Well, no, that's what your face is for. But first, we need to get you aboard. Okay, let's get him aboard. I've been expecting you. Then why are you not wearing any pants? All right, I'm gonna level with you. I was not expecting you. What do you want? <laughs> for you to wear pants. Yeah, please and put pants on. for my brother. Hmm. Okay. This one is made of birch and plywood. Okay. Ooh, and ball sack. You have something a little more... Less demonic? Yeah, yes, less yes. demonic. <laughs> of course. This one is made of bamboo and the tears of factory workers. I guess the tears right in the bamboo. Mm -hmm. There is this one. What is it? Is it the one? Okay. Ooh, okay. Perfect. She's the one. Good choice. It's also a bargain at only $199. <laughs> okay, yes, yeah, game words are expensive. Well, first, you have to learn the tricks. Here, then here. Mm -hmm. and, uh, you went to Walmart here, to get that skateboard. Then <laughs> here, then here. No. And then, then, then here in the heart, in the heart, in the heart. Here. I have to smell the tricks. Uh, yes. You know what I smell right now? The bullshit. Garbage. Yeah. Oh, well, maybe it's a uh, garbage collection day. That means they'll be collecting you. Ooh, yeah, My yeah. Because you you're garbage. Okay. Yeah. He means you're garbage. Well, what are we talking <laughs> about here? I'm saying it looks to me like you don't know how to skate. <laughs> I swear we've seen him skate before. <laughs> hmm. I doubted you for a second, but it's obvious from this over-the-top reaction that you can definitely skate. Hell yeah. Give me some tricks. Hey, what? And that's called a mute air? Yes. And the next trick is called the hospital flip. Why is it called a hospital flip? You gotta go to the hospital. Right. Moving on. The next one is called riding fakie. Oh, look over there! <laughs> oh, man. You just missed me riding fakie. That was awesome. <laughs> okay, so show me the dark side grind again. Yeah, dark side grind. Uh, what I the think fuck? I'm ready now. Can we just move on to the part where I actually skate? Hmm. Come on! Take you to Ollie! <laughs> what do you mean? Bro, I'm stop. Really stop. Uh, yeah, and you're going a little too fast. I know, man. <gasps> oh, he's going downhill. Uh, oh, the shit. Dude, jump! <laughs> Dude, going downhill sucks. Me. Just bail. I thought you were an expert in skateboarding. Uh, 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 I said I was an expert in skateboarding. There's oh, my subtle, God. <laughs> Gumball, you just, just say you don't know skateboarding. I'm a poser, all right? I never skated because I'm scared of hurting myself, okay? <laughs> the face. <laughs> what the fuck? Hey, okay. Hey, some close animation. Oh, all right. I wonder who did this. That actually looks pretty cool. All of a sudden, now he's a skater. Ooh, nice grind. This is sick. I like it so far. Which smells? Nah, it's not worth it. Let's just, just die. Good kid. Ooh. Ooh.
This is sick. <laughs> Just jump. Ooh. This is cool, man. I love that. Okay, that was a good segment. I loved it. I loved it. Ah. Uh. <laughs> Let's see if you're still laughing after this. Mm. He just did some cool ass shit. Now he can't do it. Oh, he did do it. Ooh, ooh. He certainly is scary. Just needs. Oh come on! If you can only skateboard when people aren't looking, then what's the point of skateboarding? Cool reaction. <laughs> Okay, this episode. Uh, I really liked it. You know, I thought it was actually a really cool skateboarding episode. I really loved how it was like very intriguing to see. But I was pretty sure that Gumball has skated before. So has Darwin's, if I'm not mistaken. A long couple episodes back, I, if I'm not mistaken. Also, too, that little segment with the animation. Perfect. Really loved it. I thought it was really great. I don't know who did that, but that was that was by far really impressive. I, I've never seen that type of animation. I wanted to buy like a indie artist. It kind of does a little bit, but we'll have, I'll have to check out check it out later. Yeah, overall episode is great. So let's hop on the last one. Here we go. The catfish. All right, two to start. Are you searching your name online again? No, I've learned my lesson. Every time <laughs> I close my eyes, I can still see those weird drawings of me. What? <laughs> What the fuck? <laughs> draws that stuff? No, I'm sorry. That's probably fan art of Gumball. Did you know that Rocky trained at a mime school for a whole year? Oh, nice. Hmm. <laughs> I can see how those skills would be useful to a janitor. And did you know that Mr. Yeah. Small released an album? What does it sound like? <laughs> uh, Bro, just give up suggest. on the whole lifestyle. I don't know what's even being weirder. a hippie. Grandpa Louie has an album. Plus pro Grandpa Louie. Just a fun guy looking to get into your friend zone. Mm. No, no, no. I cringed all the way back into my lower intestine. Uh-huh. That's not fun. Oh, he said that's a friend request. Being friends online with your grandpa is like taking your mom to the prom. Mm. But he's got zero friends. He's kind of right about hey, look that. Look at that post. Anyone up for a game of squash? No one replied. Oh. Squash. The lonely man's tennis. Mm. Or here. He typed. How to make friends online. He didn't realize it wasn't a search bar, so he typed sorry. I don't know who wrote that. Oh. Like, it's a terrible someone updating your status as a joke. Oh, that, that, that's sad. That's sad. Because it says Kuzo Hada Hada Gada Da. This is so sad. <laughs> no, it's not. Dude, stop hiding your tears. I know you feel sorry for him, too. Tears. I feel nothing for him. Mm -hmm. Nothing. I know you're holding back because... <laughs> <laughs> okay, are you going <laughs> It is pretty sad, man. So, you agree we need to help Grandpa Louie? <gasps> you know what we should do? What? Pretend to be his friend online by creating an entirely fictitious persona. And when you say no, should, don't do that, surely please. you mean definitely shouldn't. Nope, I mean have. Isn't Grandpa Louie too old to have imaginary friends? I know. Be imaginary to him. And besides, that comment was ageist. You're never too old to have imaginary friends. I still love you, Mr. Smiggles. Hey, what? Mr. Smiggles? He's, he's real? Don't worry. It's just a little white lie. But why do you have to make her a woman? It's just how I feel inside. <laughs> okay, so what's her name? What's her name? Muriel. Muriel? Okay. <gasps> Grandpa Louis accepted. Right. And he wants to know more about Tell Muriel. Tell me more about you. Uh, um, I like mortgages and voting. <laughs> TV, and movies, I something? cars with my driver's license. Oh, and putting cucumbers on your eyes. Yeah. Please tell That's, me more okay. about <laughs> you. Hmm. Thanks for asking. My story begins four score and seven years ago. Back oh my God. Were very very different. Jesus. As a young boy, I had no trouble making friends. In uh -huh. fact, I was so popular, I got invited to all the birthday parties. I was so well liked. Oh my God, he's still going. Louis, Louis. After the Spanish influenza, which was very popular at the time, <laughs> even animals loved me. Just put it on silent, horses. Jesus. But I never trusted horses. When I got older, things got even better. I met Jojo. She opened my eyes. Pretty Jojo. Greater. Love. Everything about her was magical. No. Her luscious ew, lips. Ew, 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 her ew. flowing hair. Oh, oh. Her cutie patootie. I'm sorry. Yeah, but yeah. I refuse to picture that last image. Goodbye, cruel world. 
Our romance it's suicide. was ravenous, insatiable. Our hearts melted oh my God. until we consumed each other like a pair of fish. Dude, just lion. stop. We spent every hour of every day. I'm gonna go bathe and disinfect them. Mm -hmm. Good idea. I'm gonna steam clean my brain. Mm -hmm. Very soon, her loving arms refused to let go of me, and she kept me captive. Her tender fingers uh -oh. held the bars of a gilded cage <laughs> from which I can never escape. Anywho, yeah. enough about me. What's your favorite food? Edible. Listen, I gotta go. That's fine. Just take your phone so we can keep messaging. Oh, come on, Louie. Don't be those type of guys. Where? Where? The cinema. Just use silent mode? Nope. God, the bathroom. Camera, Camera mode. Off mode. What if I'm in the middle of a holdup or something? Yeah. It's free mode? Ah, he just doesn't give up. What I know. Very persistent. I don't know. You're the one who wanted to help him. Mm -hmm. You're the one who came out with Muriel. I blame Muriel. I, I blame, blame Muriel. You. We have to tell him the truth and put it into this before he starts telling us things we're too young to know about. Yeah. We have to meet. There's something you should know. There's something, something you, you should, should know, know too. too. I thought I needed a friend, but the way you patiently listened to me made me realize something else. I think we're more than just Elmore oh, plus friends. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. You gonna cheat on oh, Granny Jojo? Uh, didn't see you there. You look guilty. What? Oh uh, man, he a cheater. He a cheater. So clear, spotless. You're lying. Your eyes always look to the right when you're lying. No, I'm not. What's that? Ah, oh, sorry, honey. Was that your favorite shirt? No, it was my. Favorite. I'm saying, where's this shirt at? Oh, What's skin. this heart icon? What? Oh, that, Come on, man. You, you want to cheat on Granny and Jojo like that? How unhealthy I am. Uh, Don't lie, man. Don't you dare lie. <laughs> Found you cheating on me. I'm saying, these dude, come on. looking at all my messages to Muriel. Muriel, stupid ass. I want to be more than just Elmore plus friends. Let's meet in real life. 2 p.m. at Why would y'all agree to that? I can explain. That face. I know why. Because we have to come clean. Muriel, if you happen to see a 200 pound raging rodent in a dress running towards you while screaming and wielding a sledgehammer, please stay out of her way. I know that's good advice generally, but in this specific instance, it's most likely my wife coming after you. Wait, oh my it's god, fun. just run, Muriel just run. Doesn't exist. You made her up. Where'd you get her profile picture from? From yeah, a real person. Randomly online. Okay, there's it's a real one person. funny piece yep. of news and another not so funny piece of news. Funny one first, please. When I search for her photo, all the related pictures are of guinea fowl. <laughs> <laughs> and the not so funny news is that the picture comes from the mall's website. Okay. <laughs> she works there. <gasps> Shit. Oh, please. I never meant to hurt you. Of course you didn't. Now, would you mind closing your window, dear? Sure. Why? <laughs> <laughs> so you can feel on the outside how I feel on the inside. So now we're even? Yeah. Yes, we are. But I'm not even with Muriel! Ooh. Oh my god. Just just go hurry, hurry, hurry. Muriel! Yes, dear? Oh, right. Basically, we're made of What's her name? Mine to be friends yeah, her name is Muriel or what? Sorry for him. And then her made up name is Muriel, but I forgot that wasn't a real name, which is funny because when I called her, you answered. Now you should probably jump out of the way because our grandma's about to run you over with a car. Mm, maybe I should have just said. Watch out! Uh. There she is. Grandma, no! uh. Oh shit. Nice dodge. <laughs> Where is she? Oh my god, dude, her face. Uh. Oh, oh. Look out. Yes. Not you. Oh, okay, well, let's stop it. You <laughs> can't do Johnny Jojo. Jesus. <laughs> God damn, she's persistent. <laughs> Oh, right in the face. Okay? In the face. Uh, rest will do you good. Please. <laughs> Granny Jojo, you don't get it. I may not, but she certainly will. <laughs> what the? Oh, oh my God. Ah, shit. You don't understand. Muriel <laughs> doesn't exist. We made her up. Oh. Really, Louie? Really? Problem, <laughs> man. 
Well then, who's that? We just used her photo. Mm -hmm. We made her up so Grandpa Louie could have a friend online. What? Do you know what a cat and a fish pretending to be someone else online Catfish, is Catfish, basically that. Cat? Fish? Catfish? No, it's called... Wait, actually, yes, that is what it's mm -hmm. called. But if we lied to make you happier, is that really so wrong? None of this would have happened to He's kind of right about that. So controlling. What are you talking about? Well, honey, you must admit. Is she controlling? Mm. Oh, sorry, I thought you were <laughs> to someone else. Please scan your item. Yeah. Who do you think you're talking to? He's my voice of mine. Please place your item in the bag. Thank you for your advice, Doc. I'll make sure to eat more fiber next time. Really? Come on, Grand Jojo. <laughs> You're even jealous of the X's in my X-rays. Then why did you want to be more than just friends with Muriel? I know. I meant more than just Elmore plus friends. A friend in real life. You must admit, you don't really let me see my other friends anymore. True. I love you so much. What about his, his old I homies? What about them? I was stifling you. I'm sorry. Mm. Come on. Oh. So, does this mean Grandpa Louie's allowed to have friends? Yeah. Maybe just one. <laughs> ah, he's finally got an online friend. Really? What is it? Who is it? Of course, of course, of course, of course. Woo! Okay, this episode. Uh, it was actually pretty funny. I loved how it was basically, you know, catfishing episode. Basically, where Grandpa Louie was, I thought he was cheating on her with, you know, Granny Jojo, but it turns out he just wants friends. And at least Gumball and Darren tried their best to, you know, really help out. And, you know, even though it kind of worked, like, bro, Grant, Louis just keeps going forever. But yeah, episode was really funny. You really loved it. And yeah, yeah, man, all the episodes were great today. I really enjoyed it for the most part. And if you've not seen them, please go check them out. But I want to thank y'all for watching this video. If you like, please don't like, favorite, and subscribe. I will be doing more reactions in the future. So if anything you want to check out in the future, please let me know in the comment section down below. But uh, yeah, it's been your boy Jonas. I'll see you all later.